Pronouns and antecedents. A pronoun is a word that is used to replace another noun in a sentence. It is used instead of directly referring to the object or the person. Here are some examples. Bob was late for class, so he had to hurry. He is the pronoun in the sentence, and it is replacing the noun Bob that appeared earlier in the sentence. In the second example, Michelle and Mike made the pizza that they ate for dinner. They is the pronoun in the sentence and it is replacing the nouns Michelle and Mike that appear earlier in the sentence. Here are some common pronouns. I, me, he, she, him, her, it, we, they, them, and us. An antecedent is the noun or nouns that the pronoun replaced in a sentence. Let's look back to our first two examples. Bob was late for class, so he had to hurry. We know that he is the pronoun in the sentence, Bob is the antecedent because he replaces the name Bob in the sentence. In the second example, Michelle and Mike made the pizza that they ate for dinner. They is the pronoun, and the antecedent is Michelle and Mike because the pronoun they replaces Michelle and Mike in the sentence. Keep in mind that a pronoun must agree with its antecedent in number, gender, and person. For example, there are masculine pronouns like he and him, feminine pronouns like she and her, pronouns that can be masculine or feminine depending on the sentence like I, me, we, they, them, and us, and neuter pronouns, which are pronouns that are neither masculine or feminine. The only neuter pronoun we use is the word it. An example of a neuter pronoun would be using it to replace a word like book, car, or dear.